is me trying out fake makeup so I went to my local Chinatown where if you don't know what a Chinatown is, it's basically really like a cheap kind of clothing. I got this jacket here. Yeah, doesn't this jacket look fantastic? I got this jacket for 70 Rand and it's like full on like denim jacket for 70 Rand. Bargain. But along with bargains you also get fake makeup. So I had a total jaw <laughs> looking at all the fake makeup and I bought the semi sweet chocolate bar by Too Faced, two Huda Beauty products, and a Morphe lipstick, as well as some knockoff nail polishes. Um, obviously, this is all fake makeup. And yeah, so I'm gonna be giving you the lowdown on if these really work and trying them out, and hopefully, my skin doesn't burn off um, and see if they actually really pay off. As you can see, this is the Too Faced palette. Not that great, let me tell you. And I did this makeup right here. So if you want to see how these test up and how these looked horrible on my face, carry on watching. Hey. Okay guys, so the first thing I'm going to be trying out for you is the Too Faced Semi-Sweet Chocolate Palette. Oh my gosh, look how nice it is. Um, it's fake. <laughs> okay, so when you first look at it, you're like, oh, okay, it could be, it could, it could be the real deal. Then you turn the back and the colors do not match anything that is inside. And the colors, this whole picture here is upside down to all the writing that's here. So in order to read what the colors say, you have to flip it so that this writing is upside down, but this is not upside down so um <laughs> great so yeah that is the perfect uh representation of the colors i feel such a perfect <laughs> it looks nothing like oh i'm not in focus it looks nothing like the colors inside so they did a great job faking this from a far away it looks exactly like it um Maybe the font is not exactly the same, but if you take a photo like this, ah, it looks exactly like the same. Um, also, it doesn't close properly. It's always just like coming open. The thing you get in the box is this little like um, Too Faced Semi Sweet Chocolate Bar How To Glam Guide. Glide. Where did I get that from? <laughs> So yeah, it basically just shows you um, looks, I know, right? Um, and the photos, these photos look horrible. I don't know if this is exactly like what's in the actual sweet, pa sweet paste, semi-sweet chocolate palette, but these photos are so pixelated, so outdated, so I'm just gonna put that in there because that's not gonna help me at all. <laughs> so actually opening the palette, um, it looks like this, okay. The one thing I didn't notice straight away is this color over here is not the same as the brown. It's not the same brown. And come on, it, is it that hard to match up brown? It does have a, a scent of chocolate mixed with chemicals and acid and all that good stuff. So, um,. I'm glad I'm going to be putting this on my eyeballs. <laughs> Get straight into this bad boy and then I'll go on to the rest of the face with the lips. So let me zoom you in a bit and just see the little look. Zoom, zoom, oh, getting up close and personal. Okay, so I'm going in with peanut butter and I'm just going to pop this into the crease. Oh, it's not that bad, guys. Look at that. Okay. This thing is so close to my face because I'm using the mirror and I can't breathe because of the chemicals. <laughs> oh my gosh definitely some other chemicals in here yeah? I'm just putting it on my eye it's not bad like okay it took a long time to get to that and it can be very patchy but I feel like if you just blend the flipping out out of it it's okay. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with <laughs> caramel. Oh wait, no. Pudding. Pudding. But it's pudding with no jeans, so it's 
<laughs> and that is that shade over there. Um, let's test the pigmentation of that. Let's put it next to peanut butter. Okay, that's still chalky, <laughs> but not bad. For, for Too Faced. For Too Faced, it's like, bitch, where's the pigmentation? <laughs> but um, as you all know, it's not Too Faced. <laughs> I'm going to put that on my outer corner now. And let's hope for the best. <laughs> Kind of sting a bit. <laughs> I'm gonna go light. Uh, okay, and I'm also dragging that out on the bottom lash line because why not? It's so far, it's pretty. It's um not bad. Like um, I'm able to get something decent out of it, um, which is the best I could ask for. It doesn't matter if it's chalky or burning my eyes out. Okay, so I'm deciding which eyeshadow to put um, on my lid as like a shimmering eyeshadow. So I'm <laughs> literally, ooh, that's really a bad place to swatch. Oh, God, oh, really? There we go. <laughs> um, no, there must be a better way to show you guys this. Oh, God. I chose the most awkward spot to swatch. Okay, so the ones I have the best pigmentation so far, um, frosting over here. Then caramel, bonbon, then hot fudge and truffle is nothing. And this buttered pecan is nothing. Um, so as you can see, I just swatched them all on my arm. I literally just chose the most awkward spot in the world to do it. So I think um, I'm definitely going to use um, hot frosting. Frosting, not hot frosting. Frosting because that has the best pigmentation. Um, that with um, a little eyeshadow brush it's just like a standard eyeshadow brush and I'm gonna pat that on my eye okay now I'm gonna take a lighter shade um, as I said the lighter shades oh right so um it's gonna be hard this coconut cream shade oh my brush just fell apart. <laughs> Beauty Guru! <laughs> I have no money for brushes, okay? This over here, that had the second most pigmentation. And I'm going to use this as an inner corner highlight. Oh, that's working quite nicely. Now to try out the blue shade, because the blue shade is what really got me looking at this palette. I was like, I need to try out this palette. This fake palette because the blue shade's gonna be a disgrace. Um, but the blue shade is called Blueberry Swirl. And let's give it a swatch just to see it. It's not a bad pigmentation on the finger swatch. It's just okay. It's not bad. It's it's not bad. Um, I'm being polite when I say not bad. Okay, so I'm gonna take that blue shade. And I'm going to put it at the bottom of my eye because I really want to try this. It's like a pop of colour. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay, do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to take peanut butter, this shade over here again, next to the blue shade. And I'm going to smoke that out underneath the lash line. Trying. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is horrible. It is bad. Don't even try. <laughs> even tried to anything to save it. Oh my gosh. Okay. I'm trying to. And now, um, to put this look together, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be back <laughs> when I'm gonna do my eyeliner, that's what it's called, and mascara, and we're gonna see if I can put it, pull it together and make it look like it's a hundred dollars, but it's really, it's, it's not great. <laughs> okay. 
Okay guys, that is what I could do to make it look better. I'm gonna zoom in a bit to make you see the real horrors of this eyeshadow. Is the look guys, because my eyeshadow is, my eyeline is so bad because the eyeshadow is so chunky. So if you can see that, I tried. Okay guys, <laughs> I tried. I have two lip products here that are fake products and the are uh, Huda Beauty lipsticks and Morphe. So I'm gonna do the two that I'm not gonna wear. Um, I'm just gonna swash them for you guys and then I'm gonna put on the one Huda Beauty that I'm gonna wear for the photo. Um, so the first one here is a Morphe product and this is the Morphe Liquid Matte Lipstick in Heartbreaker. Now let me tell you this, there's no such thing as a Morphe liquid lipstick in Heartbreaker. A Heartbreaker is a red Huda Beauty liquid lipstick. So I don't know where they got this shade from because it's a tube out of nothing. It's like a little doe foot applicator, very long one. Um, it smells <laughs> like chocolate again with acid and everything. So I probably shouldn't be putting this on my lips, but oh well, let's go. Okay, that is Heartbreaker by Morphe. As I said before, there's no Morphe Heartbreaker liquid lipstick, but they made a dupe out of it. Um, oh, as you can see, it's very patchy. Actually, let me try to fix that. In some places, it's very like opaque, and in some places, it's just like, I'm not going to stick here. <laughs> so, that is Heartbreaker by Morphe. Fake makeup I have now is this Huda Beauty Liquid Matte Lipstick in Trendsetter. Now this does look like it's a pretty good fake. Um, it looks like this. Packaging is good. Packaging is the same. Um, but the actual color, um, Trendsetter, Trendsetter is actually. Um, a very like nudie pink and this is very very pink so that's the one that's a budget um, again it oh my it's an overpowering smell of vanilla and chemicals so here's the color I'm just gonna put it on oh my gosh and it's very liquidy No, 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 uh, can you guys see, it's not drying down, it's like, oh, I need to get off this lip, oh, this is not nice, okay, so this does not dry down at all, and the last tube I have for you guys is also another Huda Beauty lipstick, and this is in Medusa, and um, Medusa Medusa in the actual Huda Beauty collection, I think it's more of like a ready kind of nude. It's, I, I don't I don't know if it's exactly this, um, but this is like very thick. The two formulas, um, these are both Huda Beauty lipsticks, the one I just tried on Trendsetter, but completely different formulas. The Trendsetter formula is so liquidy, it's so disgusting, and this Medusa um, formula is so thick and like... Ugh. Both have the same, just like, horrible <sighs> scent and, ugh, it's disgusting. Okay, so I'm gonna try this one now. Okay, that is Medusa. Um, <laughs> no, <laughs> no, <laughs> oh my gosh not any pigment very patchy but this is my most favorite color out of all the dupes I tried on today um and yeah that I think that is it for this week's video let me zoom you guys out so we can have a full kind of just 
of this monstrosity that's going on. Okay. Oh. Oh my gosh. Ah, it's so sticky. Oh my gosh. Can you guys see this? Ah, my lips are sticking together. I'm probably going to die. The eyeshadow looks horrible. I hate my eyeshadow. The blue looks like a muddy blue. It's nothing as electric as in the actual sh packaging. Um, everything stinks like chemicals. Um... But honestly, if I need to show off, I'm going to show this palette and I'm not going to throw this stuff away because honestly, I'm going to be like, I have hit a beauty and you don't. Um, honestly, I would just use this stuff for like photo purposes. Um, but like get the real stuff. It's so much better. Oh, I forgot. I have also two nail polishes that I bought at the same shop. Um, one is a Kylie nail polish. Kylie doesn't have nail polishes, guys. This is a dupe out of nothing. This is fake makeup of nothing. Um, the one thing I do actually love this nail polish, though. Um, it is Kylie Matte Nail Polish. It's a matte nail polish, guys. Um, and this is in Langi Kai. I don't have no idea what that means. But it's nice, this mauve kind of purple, um... And it's not like any like gloss on the actual nail when you paint it. It's just matte. So I like this. Oh, if you want a nice nail polish, don't get it because it's Kylie. Get it because it's a good nail polish. And then I also got this other NHC matte nail polish. And it's in like a nice um, metallic kind of purple color too. I love these nail polishes. These nail polishes are amazing. The amazing. <laughs> so if you're looking for great nail polishes, go to your local Chinatown or your local place where you get fake makeup from and buy the nail polishes because the nail polishes are really good <laughs> so that is it for this week's video guys i really hope you liked me almost dying and burning my face off because these products you don't know what these products have in them um it says the actual products from the huda beauty and obviously it's not because they make it half the price with half the energy with half the money um so i People don't get it because save up, get the actual product with the actual quality and yeah, and you won't be looking like a hot mess like I do right now with muddy blue eyeshadow on and a sticky lips. Just so kissable. So kissable. For this week's video guys, thank you so so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a like, comment down below if you tried other fake makeup and if you actually found some rare fake makeup that actually works <laughs> and comment down below. Uh, anything you like really and subscribe for new videos every week and hit that notification bell so you don't miss an upload thank you so so much for watching we're going to have a incredible week night day month year over here and i'll see you next week with another video bye <laughs> so let's do this video -E 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 mm. <sighs> okay are you ready my eyebrows look horrible today. Ugh. I look fabulous. Baby, so slow hands. Like sweat dripping on that dirty laundry. No chance that I'm even here without you or me. I, I know. Yeah, I already know that there ain't no stopping. Oh, and those slow hands. Don't be kidding. 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 Don't be kidding.